number of people showed up to pick up trash in Grand Rapids, but it didn't always start out so big. I got a look at how this has grown over the last 15 years and the cause behind the cleanup. Even one thing and then just yourself check in today. can affect a whole environment. First group, you are welcome to leave. So it's this big of an army. It's incredible that um, and how many people and just families coming out and doing it and bringing family together, bringing community together. The West Grand Cleanup didn't always start out so grand. Which year did it start? These two. It says yes. since 2000. 2009. Would know. It started in 2009. We had met at Union Square. What started out as a neighborhood project has grown into quite the crowd. It gives me a little bit of chills, a little bit. Um, that is just something that um, a very small uh, group of people started and then where it's come now. They started with maybe a dozen people. This year, more than 1,300. Being outside is just really healing. The fresh air, being in nature, that's what we're meant to do. All to make sure Grand Rapids stays clean. That's what we need access to. People that don't have a lot of money or resources, you know, how do we still build and design so that everybody can enjoy the earth? Even 15 years later, these founders still get down and dirty. Garbage has a tendency to be dirty, rusty, slimy. Showing the difference one couple can make. Something is your fault from what I understand. Yes, <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. And changing the landscape for the future. And make sure that we're protecting and preserving those assets for the next generation. So who knows what this many can do. This was at just one of the cleanup sites. This year they had 17 cleanup districts, so it's really grown a lot since since they first started it back in 2009. It's really grown. Yeah, it's incredible.